Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice system of equation from here? You can rewrite this as x raised to power 3, then raised to power 3, and 3 times 3 here is still 9, then plus also here we have x raised to power 3, then raised to power 2, as 3 times 2 here is 6, then equals to 56. Then from here, we can let a letter represent x raised to power 3. So let y be equals to x raised to power 3 from here. Then what we have now becomes y raised to power 3 plus y square, then equals to 36. And here, let's take 36 here. Then we have y raised to power 3 plus y square minus 36 then equals to 0 from here and what we have here when we test with the factors of 36 the one that when we substitute here the 0 0 is already the root of this polynomial the cubic equation from here then let's solve the solution by representing y square here as 4 y square minus 3 y square. Then that means we can replace this as 4 y square minus 3 y square, and which we can write as y raised to power 3. When we write minus 3y square first, then plus 4y square minus 36, then equals to 0 from here. That is, next, we can group this together to 2 here. And what is common here, we have y square, then into brackets y minus 3, then plus here, 4 is common. So we have y square minus 9 left, then equals to 0 from here. Then also here, we can write 9 here as 3 square. Then we have y square minus y square into bracket y minus 3, then plus 4 into bracket y square minus 3 square, now equals to 0 from here. Then here from using power square, a square minus b square is giving us a plus b multiplied by a minus b. That is here becomes y square minus into bracket y minus 3, sorry please, then plus 4 into bracket y plus 3, then into bracket y minus 3. Now equals to 0 from here. Now, here we have y minus 3 common. So we factor that out. So y minus 3 out. Then into bracket. What is left here? We have y square. Then plus. What is left here? We have 4 into y plus 3. Then close bracket. Which is equals to 0 from here. Then also. Open this bracket here, we have y minus 3 into bracket y square plus 4y plus 12 now equals to 0 from here. And here we have two cases that is, we have y minus 3 equals to 0, or we have y square plus 4y plus 12 equals to 0. Then from here, y is equals to 3. Then on this side to get y, if there will be a solution here using the discriminant d square minus 4ac. And where a here is 1, b is 4, and c is 12. So here it is 
continuous now equals to d square which is 4 square minus 4 times 1 times 12 which is 4 square 4 times 4 that's 16 then minus 4 times 12 here that's 48 and this gives us minus 32 which is less than 0 from here so here there will not be a real solution so no real solution on this side so the discriminant is less than 0 then on this side we have y equals to 3 then recall that you let y equals to x goes to power 3 that is we can equate this and we have x key equals to 3 then to remove this key here, we can take the key boot on both sides. So we have key boot of x key now equals to key boot of 3. Here, key cancel key boots. Then we have x equals to key boot of 3 from here. And which we can also write as 3 raised to power 1 over 3. So here we have the solution to this given problem. And from what we have, we can check if this satisfies the given problem. On the problem, we are given x raised to power 9 plus x raised to power 6 equals to 36. Now substitute the value of x which is now 3 raised to the power 1 over 3 raised to the power 9 plus into bracket 3 raised to the power 1 over 3 raised to the power 6 is this equal to 36 and when we apply the law of indices here with this power we multiply here 3 1 3 here 3 so here is left with 3 raised to the power 3 plus here also 3 1 3 here 2 2 times 1 that's 2 that's 3 square is equal to 36 then from here we have 3 raised to power 3 3 multiply itself 3 times so that's 27 plus here 3 multiply itself 2 times so that's 9 is equal to 36 and here 27 plus 9 this is 36 which is also equal to 36 so here we have left hand side equals to the right hand side and from what is given here we can therefore conclude that x here is equals to key root of 3 which is also the same thing as 3 raised to power 1 over 3 so thank you for watching don't forget to say, subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell Share this video, give a thumbs up, see you next time, bye for now.